Once upon a time, there was a boy, an orphan without a single toy. His name was Pete. His world was grey. Until he found a friend one day. It was no normal friend he'd found. She was but the prettiest girl in town. From that day on, the summer bore adventures every single morn. Her name was Wren, so young and gay. She even had a small piano she'd play. From sharps and flats to middle C, she taught Pete to play and read. But on one fateful evening they when looking for some place to play. Pete and Wren stumbled through a door onto an abandoned asylum floor. And from the shadows, a face of white snatched poor Wren out of sight. Pete was not like Wren at all. He was timid, scared, and small. And this was his last farewell, for Pete into a coma fell.
was about to adventure out to the Spiderian sewer to look for the grown-ups. Anyways, I think a grown-up might be down there. I heard it. Bird, you woke up. I'm locked in this cage. That's what's up. I just saw Ren. Yeah, a man carried her down into the Spiderian sewer. Without her medication, I don't see her lasting much longer. Okay, quick, use that bat to get me out of this cage. Pete, it is I, the mighty parkour ninja, Gumboisa. At yeah, I just saw some guy take her down into the Spiderian sewer. He was just crawling around, dragging her in a cage. Not sure if that's a problem. Um, I tried to help, honest. But, well, I already told John I'd help him find his dad. So, yeah, I'm busy. <laughs> uh, just kidding. Um, yeah. Ren taught me how to get on these egg things. Uh, she just never taught me how to get down. Still trying to work that out. disorder. I inflate randomly. Give me my sewing needle, puke fart. My mom gave it to me for emergency poppage for just such occasions. Those little turds, the spiders, snatched it right out of my pocket and ran up a tree.
Check it out in the tree. Is that Simeon's sewing needle? face only smiled. I'm starving, and I need to eat. So I snatched your pal. The perfect treat. A snack like that is said to make your wrinkling skin look younger, girl. getting weirder and weirder. <laughs> you got slut 
smeared all over my jeans. You bet your peach fuzz, you're sorry. You owe me a list of favors. Could you tell him I'm a mess him up? Wish I could beat his butt. I'm sick of him tricking me. I could never maybe if I had that bat though. Did you know that you can swing upwards with your bat and go a little bit higher than normal? Of course you did. That's why they call you the slug. apron.
I'm so confused. Now that I'm thinking about it, I heard Gumboisa talking about this a week ago. Looks like the grown-ups are turning into monsters. That can't be. Anyways, Gumboisa mentioned finding three sleeping monsters. I hate to say it, but I think we need to wake them up to find Ren. They apparently know how to sing. <laughs> exactly. Ugh, I'm glad that's over with. Kind of freaked me out. One down, two to go. Quick, let's go play that song we learned on Ren's piano. Oof. <laughs> 